I made a decision when I jumped in this To always be authentic and true when I'm speaking You see me? I got no problems with people who got problems with me I call that separating beef to maintain my peace Yeah, cause you know how the story go The kid from down the street, the kid from Mother Road He wanna be great, so he separated himself Until he got on a level that even he could say is Greater than the best I'm trying to be the greatest, even greater than my best And that's real shit, so much I haven't done yet My accomplishments has put me in a position to make it out this shit What's up, yo, what's up? MVP Master J checking back in again I know it's been a while, man TNT has been pretty good I'm going into my third week, actually by the time this is posted, going into my third week. The first two weeks has been pretty crazy with my trainer. Uh, man, been to California. California, the California load that we picked up is actually good. Man, that was the worst one. I'm not going to even lie to you. Because we ended up being stuck in California for three days. Uh, all the clips you see, it's just all different days going to California, actually. Man, we ended up getting stuck in Cali for three days. Cause man, one thing that they, one thing that's true, that's told in trucking is you will be waiting. A lot of these shippers had us waiting four plus hours, and for two of them, it was just for one pallet. Those had us waiting for the longest. We had a multi pickup, and then we're dropping to. Uh, Massachusetts man and it's just been crazy uh, while we were in Cali ended up having multiple incidents getting us stuck well I mistakenly almost burnt out the brakes going down going down a downgrade I think it was a six or seven percent in the hills of California so I had us stuck for a while and then the shippers, that was the second incident, the shippers having this wait to be loaded for one pallet for almost six plus hours. And then the last incident, it started snowing and we had to put in chains when we was leaving California finally. We had to put in snow chains because it started snowing in the northern part of Cali. It's crazy, man. When, when, so I got the experience putting in snow chains. Not only did I have to get the experience for the first time, going down going down grade but i also got the experience putting on chains a lot of stuff i didn't record because i'm mainly focusing on just you know getting the whole process but man this is just a short little video that i put together and we caught a flat tire that one of the chains ended up popping on the trailer tires and we got a flat end up waiting for roadside and yeah that's what's been going on man but appreciate y'all Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, you know. I'll try to drop as much as I can, but I'm more focused on just trying to understand the job and understand trucking and, you know, my role and what I need to do and complete and be better at doing the job. So, I'll let y'all, man. Appreciate it. Like, comment, subscribe, holla. Listen, man. L.A. doing me good right now. Got some tacos, some steak tacos, dog. <laughs> they had a food truck. I knew this shit was gonna be fire when the lady, when the cook couldn't even speak English. I'm like, oh, I know this shit about to be fire as fuck. And guess what? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hell yeah. Mm. Listen, auntie put her foot in this. Thank you, Consuela. 